Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm C Tech Dude. Thanks for joining me today. Today we're going to be looking at trading cards. More specifically, these Cardsmith cryptocurrency cards. C U R R E N C Y. Because I'm out of video ideas and I enjoy collecting trading cards, or at least I used to, back when Pokemon and Yu Gi Oh were cool. And I mean, I was too back then, obviously. And now we're on to currency cards because I browse Reddit for the GameStop memes and super stock for the GameStop info and these are all the rage on super stock so i want to check them out see what they are see if they're worth buying and open a few packs live for you if you're not sure what these cards are they depict influential persons memes and other things related to currency that have shaped currency as we know it pretty much and if that sounds interesting to you there's also they also partner with top artists digital comic artists and all kinds of indie artists to create some really cool cards so Let's get started, let's check these things out. Hope you enjoy the video. Here we go. So before we get started opening the cards, I wanna give you a, a, some brief backstory to these. Um, along with like some rare foil cards, there's also some gemstone refractor cards, which are pretty cool, I'm assuming. And they've also randomly inserted redemption codes into these packs, uh, series one packs, that award people with actual cryptocurrency. And there's actually two whole Bitcoins hidden somewhere in here, along with some Dogecoin, Litecoin, Ethereum. And that's pretty, that's the main appeal of these is that you can actually win real money. Kind of like going to a slot machine and hoping for the best, but you actually get something in return. You get some cool cards. So that's the backstory. Uh, the odds of actually finding a cryptocurrency redemption code is like one in 96, which isn't terrible. And then uh, hollow foils one to one, crystal sparkle cards are one to two, gemstone refractors are one to 10, and the meta rare refractors are one in 124. So you have, odds of finding some pretty cool cards but the main draw to these is the cryptocurrency card at least that's my best guess so let's get started with the opening here we go all right so let's see what we have hopefully we have something pretty rare or at least maybe a cryptocurrency card would be nice so you never know. So each pack we get five cards. You get two packs per box. Let's see what we got. Okay. A moon. That's a pretty cool looking pyramid. Holographic. Some flowers and that guy. So nothing really worthwhile in that pack. That's okay. And back holders, that's uh, fitting. <laughs> Let's see what we get in this pack. Here we go. Got a diamond guy. Bitconnect. That's a pretty cool card. That's kind of cool too. The having. Nice. And just a Bitcoin thing. I thought I got excited. I thought it was one of the Bitcoin redeemable codes, but it was not. So there we go. So box number one down. Let's see what we get in the next box. Just exciting opening cards. Even if I don't get anything, you know, I'll be disappointed. But it's not the end of the world. At least I get to open the cards and experience the thrill of the unknown. As Elsa says, you know, we're going into the unknown. If you know, you know. If you don't know, you probably don't have a kid. <clears throat> Let's see what's in here. Two packs. Let's open this one first. Here we go. <clears throat> Another Bitcoin card. Shiny Miner card. Shiny Bag Holder card. I think I got that one from the last one as well. Looks like Ethereum. And Mount Gox. Okay, nothing too exciting. Got a couple of shiny cards, but nothing super rare. So let's see what's in this, this pack. Pizza. 
May 22nd was the first day that Bitcoin was used to make a pizza purchase. Okay, I remember that. The moon. Holographic light guy. Ooh, that one's rare. 132 out of 149. Sweet. Only 150 of these cards, or 149, wherever printed, so that's cool. We got gold currency card and a Satoshi Nakamoto card. Cool. So we got one thing that's pretty cool so far. We have one more box to go, which means 10 more cards. So let's open the Saran Wrap here. And see what's inside. Sorry if you're cringing at me destroying this box. <laughs> Hopefully the boxes aren't valuable in the future because I'll feel bad if they are. But you know, I live in the moment. I think about today. Two more packs. Let's go on the right again because that was good to us last time. Come on, big money. No whammies. Another Satoshi, that's pretty cool. Looks like Indiana Jones. Satoshi Nakamoto card. Another shiny light bulb guy. I already have one of those. Elon Doge card. A bad word card. And an Abraham Lincoln card. I liked Lincoln, mostly because he hunted vampires, which is pretty cool. And last pack for this box. Dogecoin card. Nice. Another moon card. Ooh, that's a pretty cool Ethereum card. I like that. That's pretty. And a couple more. Nothing nothing of value cards. Cool. So we got one pretty cool card. Um, you know, it was a fun experience. Got about 40 cards. Well, whatever. 30 cards. So, cool. That was fun. Well, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. These cards are fun. Um, right now, there's a buy three, get one free deal going on at GameStop, which is why I got these cards. They're still 30 bucks a pack, which is pretty steep, but you actually do have odds of winning real money, so you can make that back. And some of the cards are actually selling for about $30 a piece on eBay. Um, so it's up to you. They may not be your cup of tea, and that's fine. Um, I'll probably buy some more in the future if I get some extra scratch, uh, which is, you know, slang for cash if you're not in the know um but yeah I, I enjoy opening cards and always finding cool things i'll put some of these in sleeves and hold on to them and maybe pass them down to my kids and they can pass them down to their grandkids and maybe they'll be worth as valuable as beanie babies someday anyways guys hope you enjoyed the video if you did make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more cool content hope you enjoyed this hope you enjoyed this format of video kind of off the cuff vlog style um and that's why i can actually show my personality because i'm not reading from a script and i actually enjoy these more so I may do more of these in the future. If you liked it, let me know in the comments. And hope to see you. Hope to see you here again soon. You just got CE Tech. Talk to you next time. Bye bye.